Breaking, SM Entertainment's current CEO Lee Sung Soo accuses Lee Soo Man of ruining Aespa's comeback plans. Originally, Aespa was set to release a new album on February 20th, ahead of their first solo concert in Seoul. However, during the album production process, Lee Soo Man ordered Yoo Young Jin and Aespa's A&R team to change the lyrics of the group's comeback song to include references to tree planting and sustainability. Despite the fact that these themes did not fit in with Aespa's metaverse storyline, Yoo Young Jin and the A&R team attempted to include lyrics such as just sustainability and decrease by just 1%. However, CEO Lee Sung Soo ultimately made the decision to cancel Aespa's comeback as the group's new song was ruined. The Aespa members even shed tears after hearing that their new song would be scrapped. Furthermore, Lee Sung Soo accused Lee Soo Man of attempting numerous overseas real estate dealings even when he was denied purchase of land in certain countries, and also alleged that Lee Soo Man planned on installing casinos at his music cities, despite the fact that these music cities would mostly attract tourists and consumers in the teens and twenties. Furthermore, Lee Sung Soo stated that Lee Soo Man was an advocate of legalizing marijuana, which would allow people to enjoy music and entertainment even more.